Hi, Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches and another far north adventure. This was an early morning search close into the coastline, trolling stick baits and slinging soft baits. Stick baits can be trolled, and this way we covered ground until we found a fishy spot. While searching the Kelpie shallows, Piper jumped for their lives, so I picked up the stick bait to see if any kingfish were lurking nearby. But it was probably just a kahawai. Back to the soft baits in the wash, probing the drop offs and fowl. Jody scored a little fella. Good to see they were open to hitting our lures. I checked this rocky channel. It looked pretty fishy, and sure enough, something fishy grabbed my bait and wanted to take it home. Hmm, target species, but not the target size. The Z Man motor oil colour was convincing though. We moved out deep for a slow drift at a well known Turakihi spot in about 60 metres. I was slinging an orange Daiwa Koga when I got a solid hit. I had the Shimano Tranks loaded with 20 pound braid, so I was pretty confident it was coming home, unless the hook pulled. A decent little poray surfaced, a fish often taken alongside Tarakihi and fair eating. A better hit this time, maybe a bigger poray. Hard to tell, but it gave me a lot of trouble swimming around the boat. Happiness turned to disgust. Barracuda have their place in the ecosystem, but preferably not on my hook. We headed up the coast towards Cape Brett to have a go at soft baiting the reefy areas up there and found some friendly dolphins on the way. We had had some success in these areas before and it looked really fishy. However, after a fair amount of arm flexing and twitching, nothing had bit the lures despite everything looking good. So we made the call to head down towards the coast of Whangaruru. This move paid off pretty quick with a good fish on the first drift. The afternoon got slow and we got relaxed. We thought the action was dying out, but while heading in we found an anchovy massacre in progress. Schools of kahawai and juvenile kingfish smashed huge schools of anchovies all around us and everything was going ballistic. In only 3 to 8 metres of water, fish and birds from all over the harbour were chowing down on chovies. It was carnage and chaos, bent rods and screaming reels, fishermen's paradise.
anchovy sized lures were smashed and that kahawai smashed my last one. It was a good day that finished with another incredible display of nature in full on feeding mode. A good day's fishing with a good mate. This is Scott from Digital Fish with content that catches.